my brother's dream was to go to Disney World because like oh, wow. it was his first time. I chose to go to Chicago because I really wanted to go to the American Girl Store. Her dream that she chose was to go to Disney, give kids the world. Dream Factory is where you can go to uh, lots of things like the Royals. There's a lot of suffering in the world. Many children have critical and chronic illnesses and our dream kids are those kids. Being confined to a wheelchair or unable to attend school with other children as a result of a life-altering illness can be devastating for a child. This is where the Dream Factory can help. My brother, he has a sickle cell and he has to go through a lot of pain and trouble. He usually goes to the doctor to go doctor. get a blood transfusion and the blood comes out and I don't like it. To go to Disney World as a family would be a good relief of his pain. We stayed at this little villa and it was the world with free Village. ice cream and everything is free. Swimming. Mm -hmm. He mostly had fun swimming. Eat ice cream, roller coasters and space mountain. It was fun and I was the bravest. Okay, y'all time up. The joy that these dreams bring uh, just makes me sleep better at night knowing that they're, they're truly happy. Unlike many dream organizations, we do provide dreams to children with critical and chronic illness. As a physician, I know that that's going to be a very big part of their treatment to make them have something to hope for and it gives them something to distract them from their illness. Uh, we consider that a big part of their treatment. I have acute lymphoblastic leukemia, or ALL. Um, I'm in the maintenance phase of my treatment, and that means that I only have to go into the clinic once a month. I really don't like the steroids. Um, they make me lose a lot of my energy, and my vision gets all blurry. It's been scary, and there's been a lot of things that have been hard to do. I chose to go to Chicago because I really wanted to go to the American Girl Store. It made me feel um, overjoyed. I was really excited that my entire family got to come as well. I got a new doll named Jubilee. We got a four-hour tour of Chicago. I went to Navy Pier. It helped make me feel better because after all I've been through, it was good to be able to get away and just forget about everything else and go with my family to have a good time. To see the completion of a dream makes me feel great. I have a tendency not to complain about anything. I became involved as a Dream Factory volunteer because I wanted to make a difference in my community. I wanted to give, but I received so much more in return. Over 5,000 volunteers across the country donate their time and talents to our local chapters. As a Dream Factory volunteer, I see firsthand the results of my efforts. She had um, a non-convulsing seizure and we thought it was just going to be epilepsy. Um, it ended up that she had a focal glioma in the pons, which is a brain tumor. Uh, there's no treatment, there's no surgery, and there's no survival with this. When we were accepted by the Dream Factory, it was overwhelming. They took care of everything. We went down to um, Disney, Give Kids the World, met all her fabulous princesses, right? I remember getting the ice cream, though. That was fun. She actually just had her MRI recently, and her tumors decreased in size. Even though it decreases, we'll keep praying to stop the brain tumor. That's right. And it makes us want to go out and help more people, right? The neat thing about Dream Factory and why we wanted to be involved too with them is that they don't just stop it at the dream. Fulfilling a dream uh, and seeing the effect that it has on the family is very heartwarming. It's a very uh, special feeling that I would encourage anyone who wants to participate as a volunteer, you will be repaid back several times by the, the time and effort and talents that you provide. The illness I was diagnosed with was Wilms tumor kidney cancer. It was attached to uh, both. From what I've heard from my mother, she said I really didn't complain much. I saw everyone went through cancer when I was a kid. I just thought it was part of life. The dream I did was go down to uh, Disney World. I think it's a very big deal.
The continuing contact events at Dream Factory is where you can go to uh, lots of things like the Royals, MU Games, and I got to meet Carl Edwards. That was pretty cool. My friend Joey, he's a really nice dude. I met him through uh, Dream Factory events, and without Dream Factory, I probably would never have met him. Most places just grant you your dream, but this one stays with you the whole way. We can't get rid of all pain and sorrow for kids with critical and chronic illness, but we can add joy to their lives. There is this one quote I heard, men can last uh, three, three weeks without uh, food, three days without water, three minutes without air, and only one second without hope.